guys, welcome back. Um, this is week two of my 12-week uh, training program that I'm doing. Um, I'm currently um, participating in a 12-week uh, training study by the Strength Athlete, um, something Bryce Lewis has prescribed. So here we are, starting off the week with um, squats and bench press. This is my uh, squat hypertrophy day. Um, this is pretty much uh, from last week. We're increasing the volume by sets and reps and the intensity. So this is four sets of eight at 275. Um, this week was feeling really good, like it was feeling way lighter than last week at 265. Um, this is my last set of eight. Um, let's just have a look here. There we go. Definitely hitting depth. Generally, I like a little bit of a closer stance, and I don't really control the weight down as much as some people, but I really kind of um, use the uh, use the stretch reflex at the bottom to really explode out of the hole. So, but these were feeling real good. The hips were feeling nice and nice and solid. Um, I've been in increasing food um, since about four weeks before Christmas. Um, increased my body weight to from about 160 to around 164 right now and I'm feeling a lot better because of that. Um, shoulders been giving me some hassle so I think at the start of this week um, it was really painful. I hadn't quite seen my Cairo yet. Um, so this was the power day. Um, three sets of five, uh, four sets of four at 195. As you can see I'm probably not controlling down the eccentric as much as I should mainly because there's a really sharp stabbing pain in my shoulder here. So moving on to day two, bench strength day. Um, so there's three sets here. There's a set at 205 for five, 210 for five, and then a quick back off at 205 again. So three sets of five. Again, just trying to work through the pain. I did see my Cairo on uh, Thursday, and I found out that I had an impingement and a tear in my supraspinatus, plus a lot of tight external rotators. Um, so yeah, he really worked to that, and then I was actually pain-free after his treatment. So uh, moving on to deadlifts, this is uh, deadlift power basically. Um, five sets of three at 375. You've got three clips here from some different angles. Again, just working off, uh, working on the speed of takeoff. Final set. Actually, training's been going really well. Um, couldn't be happier on that side of things. Strength has been increasing pretty quick. So it's only week two, but we'll see uh, at the end of the 12 weeks. Um, so three sets of five, 295. This is the, the more of the strength day. Um, been told basically wear belt as much as possible. And usually I won't wear a belt unless it's kind of around the you know 85 or 90% mark, but Kind of makes sense, get used to the specificity of the movement. So yeah, only the one set there. Uh, I did the three sets, but only the one set shown. And then just mucking around a little bit, doing some handstand push-ups on a, on a deficit. I think I did like three or four sets of three, just... Uh... It's strange, like uh, with, with my shoulder issue, this was actually, actually fine. It's only the bench movement that really does. Um, um, flare up. Okay, moving on to the last day, we've got bench, bench hypertrophy, uh, three sets of eight at 185. Basically just uh, keeping sets and reps the same, but increasing the, the load each week here. Um, we're going to hit a point in the next few weeks where volume is pretty much at its highest, and then we'll start to, you know, the intensity will ramp up as the volume ramps down, and uh, you know, as we kind of move towards a peak peak week. Um, bench was feeling good on this day. I actually sorted out my shoulder. Um, no issues there. Um, final day of deadlifts, 390 for 4 by 4 Let's just watch this. All in all, the lifts were going really, really well. Um, I think I was shooting my hips up a little bit too quick here, not quite staying as tight as I probably could. Alright, and as the video comes to the end right now, thank you for watching and have a good week.